I'm a diplomat. It is my job to, to uh, conduct foreign policy which serves my uh, national interests and which serves what I believe is a long-term pathway towards uh, peace and uh, dialogue. In a strong retort to the European Union's recent criticisms of India's energy imports from Russia, a senior Indian diplomat exposed what they called glaring hypocrisy on the part of the EU. The diplomat pointed out that while India has faced accusations of aiding Russia due to increased energy imports, the EU conveniently ignores its own actions. The statistics spoke volumes. India's imports from Russia have risen, but in the same period, the EU imported a staggering six times more energy from Russia. The diplomat argued that such an imbalance in energy imports should be considered before leveling accusations against India. Furthermore, the diplomat highlighted the significant income disparity between India and the EU. India's per capita income stands at $2,000, while the EU's per capita income soars to $60,000. This vast economic difference plays a crucial role in shaping each country's energy choices and options. The impact of the EU's decisions on the global energy market was also brought into focus. By redirecting production and driving up prices, the EU's actions affect energy importing countries like India more profoundly, as they cannot afford similar measures due to financial constraints. The Indian diplomat called for a more balanced and pragmatic approach to address global energy stability, recognizing the unique challenges faced by each nation. It remains to be seen how this diplomatic exchange will shape future discussions on energy policies and the dynamics of global geopolitics. Russia is India's most important supplier of weapons and military equipment. And therefore? Uh, Are you reluctant to criticize Moscow? No, I think, look, we have a relationship with Moscow. We've had a long-term relationship with Moscow. I think it's important to look at that history of the relationship. It was a relationship built in a period when Western democracies used to arm a military dictatorship called Pakistan.